What's up, Mercs? It's Joe here with some more Fallout Frost. Last time we found this floating shanty town, and today we're going on to the freighter. So, let's get a move on. Now, we did pick up 10 308 rounds last time from one dude, which is very, very generous of him to give us so much ammo. Okay. That was not what I was expecting. Huh. U.S. Army Remnants. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that at all. This dude's, like, sitting. Alright, well, I gotta try and headshot him. There we go, he's almost dead. Let's finish him off. Or miss, you know, that works too. There's the other one. He's up there taking cover. I need to kill these guys before they actually see me and kill me. Okay, he ran off because I almost killed him. Okay, U.S. Army Remnants on the freighter. That... Okay, I know why they were fighting before. I, I understand now. I... I mm. Wasn't expecting that, though. There might be something frost-related here after all. Is that a power armor, dude? Fuck me! Get in the water! Underwater. Was that power armor? That was power armor. I just saw it. I, I, like, in the corner of my eye, right when I killed him. There was definitely someone wearing power armor, and he was a U.S. Army remnant. Army? Why do I keep saying army? Because I see remnant, army, you know? The, the, you know, it gets in my head. Yeah, that's power armor. Son of a bitch! Oh, he's fighting someone, though. If I can just break off a piece or two, that would be great. Oh, he has a flamer? That's it? Really? Oh, fuck. He's gonna be easy to kill. Kind of. Okay, so there's the weakened guy up here. See, the problem with power armor is you need really precise shots once you blow off, like, a piece of their armor, so it's gonna be really hard for me. Because of my weapon sway. Let's drink some of our alcohol. I think we have bourbon? Yeah. Okay, where's that other one? I want to finish him off so he doesn't, like, poke me out when I'm not paying attention to him. Do I have anything that can take on... An a power armored dude close range. Yes, I do. Lots of lots of frag mines, plasma mine, and he's a flamer. Okay, he's a flamer unit. As long as he doesn't pick up a rifle, which I guess is possible. He might be able to be okay. Uh, actually, it's extremely possible that he'll pick up a rifle. I don't know if the AI sees a laser gun better than a flamer. If it does less damage, he won't. But, like, it, it is better because it's a long-distance engagement. But I don't think the AI takes that into consideration. I think it's, like... Oh god, hiccups. I think it's like, oh, this does more damage, therefore, it is better. You know, that kind of thing. Where's that other one? Fuck, I need to find that other remnant. I really need to blow that guy's helmet off, too. And the other remnant was patrolling up top. We just went undetected, which is really good for us. Let me try and pop his helmet. Or miss, you know, whatever. Whatever floats the boat, right? Fuck, dude, if I would hit that shot, it would be perfect. It was like the best shot I could have had on him. Okay. We're not going to do a lot of damage to that armor's off. And if I keep missing like that, we're not going to do a lot of damage, period. Headshot. Damn, he moved backwards. Stop swaying. Go forward. Go forward. Fine. Shoot you again. I mean, I guess I could use... Oh, I, I took his helmet off. Okay, let's do this in a smart way. I can just kill him real quick. Let's get Psycho Jet and let's finish him. <laughs> what? That was a headshot. That was two headshots. Holy shit, dude. Your head is made of titanium. Fuck me, dude. I need our psycho jet. Ah. Holy 
fucking dude. This guy's head is so tough. Shit. I'm almost out of water, too. I'm out of water, actually. Which is really problematic. I'm gonna drink some of this dirty water. And then use Psycho Jet again, because I have to finish him off. And Psycho Jet is the only thing that gives me damage boost here. Like, look at that. You see the blood? I'm definitely not hitting his armor. These are headshots. Fuck! You would have been dead! No! Don't storm now! Don't storm now! Come on. No, fuck, I missed the last shot. There we go, he's dead. Fuck me! I gotta save. God damn, that guy was hard to kill. Holy shit! Please save the fucking game. And it's a rad storm, so I might want to just sleep it out. Which, yeah, you know, if you, if you really think about it, no, you shouldn't be able to sleep through a rad storm because you'd be, you're out in the radiation, doesn't make any sense. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I know. It's kind of breaking immersion a little bit, I know. But you know what? It's a mechanic I could use, so I'm gonna take advantage of it. Just kind of like how I can uh, click sleep without actually sleeping. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Please don't tell me. Oh God. Oh God. Please no. Why is Why is he here? Okay. That worked. Are there more? I'm found. Where's the other ones? Where's the rest? Why are you here? Sir? Sir, where's your... Sir, why, where's your higher up? Sir? Bastard. Whoa, I just picked up a lot of cells, though. Holy shit. That one does way more damage. It doesn't have a scope or anything, which is bad, but the damage is nice. I actually kind of want the musket, because... Well, no, 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 it charges up two shots. So, yeah, it actually does do more damage. It does 62 if it charges up times two. I'm not sure how it works. I've actually never looked at the mechanics of that. But, yeah, because it's scoped, it's going to be better. It really is. Just because of how the insanity is working out right now, it really is just going to be better to do this. Uh, I'm going to save again, even though I literally just saved, because... Okay. I don't want to die. Every... Or I don't want to have to fight the guy every time I fucking die. Because that's going to be frustrating. Oh my god. Look at this place. There's just survivors everywhere. Holy shit. They put them in with dogs? Mole rats. This one looks like they just starved to death. Is this the army doing this? These guys are fucking nuts. I did see a way to get over there from this way. There was a, uh, a crane thing. Or an elevator thing on like a... It was like a moving platform. It was over here. So yeah, see that wire right there? I saw it move across over here. That's the way up there. I'm trying to vats just to see if I can get a glimpse of one of them. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch this out for the 50 cal receiver. Because I do have 5 bullets of that. And that might actually be better in this situation. And then, yeah, let's just go. We'll see how this works. Let's go ahead and load up the Reba with our 50 cal. Okay, so here is the... This is it. Oh, man. Let's do it. Please don't have, like, a vertebra just to come out of nowhere. I mean, like, the power armor dude was, like, enough, right? That had to be their main cav, right? There's no way they can have two. Right? Oh, here we go. Well, I've made it, and I'm not dead. Some beer bottles. Got an armor workbench, some buff out, very nice. Day tripper, okay, I guess. Hot plate, meh. I don't 
really want to grab screws right now. It's not my priority at the moment. I need to get the jump on anybody I see. Oh my god, look at all that shit. Black flight suit? What? Cool. Because if I don't get the jump on them, I won't be able to kill them. Because, also, that just gave me a lot more ammo than I was expecting. Because I picked up 10, that gave me way more than 20. So it doesn't just straight double. Shit. You know someone's giving me in the comments for the last episode saying, No, it actually doesn't straight double. It does this, this, and this. I mean, you know, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. Good. Point out when I'm wrong. Seriously. I should be pointing out when I'm wrong. I don't want to give misinformation. Any misinformation given is just me being ignorant, and I would like to learn, so point out when I'm wrong. I appreciate it. Hi! Hi, buddy. Yeah, I thought I'd hit him. I don't know why I thought that. I don't know, because I could vats him! Why did I think that? I don't know. I got... I got... I shouldn't even have panicked. He was just sitting there. Hello? So he's below me right now. Hopefully I can go back to... Ah, oh, this guy's charred! I can go back to undetect and just jump on him. See, I don't know the layout of this place, so he might know how to get to me, and I don't know how to get to him. Shit. Oh, wait. Oh. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Got it. Uh, frag grenades, I'll take. Great Mentats, I'll take. Radix, of course, I'll take. Um... I need to drop something here. Oh, no, I don't. I just drink bourbon. What am I talking about? That helps. Okay, good, run detected. So he's on the opposite side of me. There's nothing here. There's no, like, notes or anything? I feel like there would be. Maybe this is just an army remnant's outpost. And that's it. Man, I was expecting more. How'd he get over there? Where is he stuck? He's still stuck there. I don't know how he got there. I don't think you're supposed to actually be able to get over there. I think he's stuck. That's why when, you know, I was being searched for, he couldn't find me unless... No, I think he's actually stuck. I think he fell down and he got stuck in there. Oh my god. Also, yeah, that's 100 flamer fuel if I picked that up, but that's also, like, a lot of weight, so no. Or, well, if it doubles like it normally does. So I haven't searched this floor yet. There could be another one up here. I just stood up. I didn't mean to. Right, well, I meant to, but I shouldn't have. Look at all this alcohol! I'm just gonna drink it right now. There's some of it. You get my sanity back a little bit. It's never coming back fully, but you never know. Maybe I'll get it back one day. No. No, I won't. God, there's so much alcohol here. I really needed this a while ago. Oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? A loading screen? Are you fucking kidding me? I don't want to do that! Look at all this alcohol, though. Holy shit. We are set for life with alcohol. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go through a loading screen right now. Not at all. Where the, where the fuck is he? He got stuck somehow. I don't know how. Did he fall? There's a hole somewhere this cunt fell through. I don't think you're supposed to be where he is. Maybe you are. I don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe he's like right here. No, he's like, he's right underneath me. How do you get in there, man? He probably... Oh, you know where he, where he went. I can like, jump off the side here. I don't want to kill myself. Hello? Okay, I have the third person here. Yeah, he's stuck there. You see that? Oh, he's, he's fucking glitched in there. Alright, I'm gonna have to kill him, but I don't want to die, so... Because, like, I could get fucked really badly for killing him. So what I'm gonna do... Disabled? What? Oh, I can't enable god mode at all in fucking... Oh, man. I wanted to enable god mode, just kill him. Just because he's sitting in the wall, I don't want to get killed in the wall. Because, like, I don't know where he can shoot, so he might just one-shot me. So I'm just gonna go over here. Yeah, okay! I'm not trying to cheat. I won't even loot him, okay? I promise. I won't even fucking loot him. You know what? I could just do the kill command. Fuck it. 
I don't want to even loot him. I'll leave his body. I won't check what he has, but I won't even fucking take anything that's important. But I need to kill him. What if this is an important dude? I don't know. Can I click him from here? I don't know if it's him. Okay, there we go. Do you have anything important on you? No. I'm not going to take that 556 because I killed him in a bad way. I'm not going to take anything. Even though that antiseptic looks tempting. Nope, nope. I don't care. Even if most of you guys are like, well, I don't care. He was glitched anyway. I don't care. Wait, didn't I just turn TCL off? TCL? Turn it off? Oh, no, no, no. I turned it on for him. There we go. Whoops. I got scared for a second when I typed in TGM and it said God Mode to say, I'm like, wait, I had God Mode on the whole fuck? Like, what? Because I was using ammo and God Mode prevents you from using ammo, but no, it just, you can't turn God Mode on on, uh, on Survival Mode. I didn't know that. Funny enough, I've never tried. Hmm. That's interesting, actually. But, whatever. It's not like it applies to me anyway. Okay, 50 caliber, let's do this. Liberty Six Captain's Quarter. Spam that tab button like never fucking before. Oh. There's gotta be someone in here, right? Oh. Looks like we found the stuff that was, uh... Oh my god, there's so much stuff. There's a lot of stuff to read here. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta raid. We got a lot of reading to do. Also, that guy looked unique. Hold on. Buddy, let me see your face. Oh, let me, come on. Don't want no zombies. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try to remember my best what I just picked up. I think I picked up four things. The first one is a key. The second one is the operation log. Uh, shit. I probably should have read them out loud to myself and I would have remembered. Operation log. Here's one. Operation Liberty found. Status log A3BX29. Primary target. Alias Bishop. Neutralized before team arrival. No sign of package Hotel Romeo. Survivor. Elias. Is it Scarlet? Or Scariot? Or is it Is... Iskariot, Iskariot, yeah. Iskariot, taking a recon bunker. Bunker Theta via Vertibird for questioning. Okay, recon bunker Theta. That will be where we have to go. There's a Vertibird, though. Here's the access code. Um, was it Roth Sheffield's journal? No, I don't think so, was it? Mm. I know one was order form. Here's, here's this one, order form. Recipient, Bishop Troy. The following information is of extremely sensitive nature. I trust you will maintain the utmost discretion in handling this matter, as I know you have had. Re wait, as I know you have had in regards to our mutual friend. The package you will receive in Oslo represents a significant investment on our behalf of the institution I represent. Our associate will transfer the package into your care and previously discussed locale, and you will proceed to U.S. waters before docking in Boston. Package HRD4 will be transferred to a second ship, the Liberty Six. And an associate will meet you there to retrieve the package and administer compensation. Dr. Richard Lerna, this is the quest line I was fucking looking for. Yes. Troy Bishop, that's what it was. 10, 28, 77. I'm fucked. The Columbia went down and with her the package. Dealing with Lerna is going to be a bit tougher, seeing as my levers just went down the drain. The back door key is gone too. To make things worse, the crew's mutinous imbeciles. The crew's mutinous imbeciles. This isn't the end of the world. I know what Lerna is. He's alive, and he's waiting. 4-15-82. I don't believe it. Survivors from the Columbia. Iskar says he got the package and the key to boot. He's been at liberty this whole time, building the place into a goddamn fortress. We're back on. Meeting him there. Oh, I didn't see the back door key. Oh, fuck. I hope the back door key's not supposed to be here. I think they might have... Wherever that package is, that's where the back door key is. Unless... This is a novice lock, which means anyone can pick it, which means there could be something essential in here. That's it. Vegetable starch. Interesting. It's actually really useful, normally. Um, I, actually, it's still pretty useful now with adhesive. Uh, we got terminal here. Six Semper Tyrannus. Thus always to tyrants, I remember sitting at a broken card table all those years ago, repeating the words as if the basement was the floor of the Roman Senate. We thought we could make a difference, free ourselves from the bonds of tyranny, but what do we have to show for it? I'm a goddamn smuggler and everyone else at their table is dead now. 
I know my part. Nearly there. Found some good people. Brought them to the Liberty. Plenty of rations, weapons. This place is really starting to come together. Even got them old, some, some old uniforms for when Bishop, Bishop returns. I'll tell them they were part of the crew. It's not like he knew them well enough to tell the difference. Then we finish this. Okay, so... Okay. So, okay. Oof. A lot of trickery going on here. Okay, so basically... I'm gonna recap because uh, I know I'm sure there's people who know the story better than me. Oh, that's a unique weapon. And again, don't spoil the story for me, but just I, I want to make sure I'm I'm you know following it correctly and I'm making sense of everything. So basically, there this guy's a smuggler. I'm gonna we're, we'll assume this is Troy Bishop. I don't know. I mean, fuck, this could be. I really don't know. But there was a smuggler named Troy Bishop. He was smuggling something for Doctor Alerna. And if something was HRD4, it's a package. We don't know what that package is. Now, the U.S. Army remnants have come here to take said package, but that was not found here. So they took the one survivor, Scariot, or Iscariot, Iscariot, which is what they designated him, and they took him to Recon Bunker Theta. Do I have that marked on my map now by any chance? I can't remember where Recon Beta Bunker Theta is. We'll just have to find it eventually. But, uh... I don't know if it marked it. I don't think it did. See, I, I can't remember where the recon bunker is. We'll have to uh, explore. Also, we have something to look at the chapel for. We might find something there. Yeah, I don't know. I'll have to look around for that. But, but yeah. And so we have to go to the recon beta or the recon bunker theta in order to. What was that? Is that Cambridge Labs? I just. Why is that not? I thought I was there. I mean, I had to go in, but I thought I was actually there. So we had to go to Recon Bunker Theta in order to figure out what's going on. And uh, see if we can't find HRD4. If we want to... I mean, we don't need to find it, but it sounds like it might be important. So we probably should look for it. Also, uh... I want the key to the back door, because I'm really interested in the back door. Bingo. 25% damage and limit damage has more recoil. So we have a really good shotgun. That's basically what we just found. Uh, I have 22 shells. It's pretty damn good, I gotta say. But I don't know if I want to take it. I probably will, but we'll have to do some inventory fuckery in order to do that. Now, what's really sad, I'm just double checking. I really hope, like, the back door key isn't in here and I'm just, like, completely glossing over it. Because I'm gonna hate myself. I, well, I'll just come back if, if someone's like, Hey, you dumbass, it was, it's right there. You fucking idiot. What are you, what are you, dumb? Oh my god. Oh, fucking moron, dude. But, um... More importantly, I have to drink some dirty water, unfortunately. Just get my, uh... There we go. I don't want to drink anymore. More importantly... We have a lead. So, I'm getting guess that the basement key is... We'll find more about the basement key at the bunker. That's... That would make sense to me. Because I don't see why we wouldn't. So I think we're good to go. Oh, yeah, all the alcohol in here. Um, I don't need it. You know how I was, like, complaining before how I need alcohol so bad? Well, now that our insanity, we, we can tell, is never going back down, and it's just, we're fucked in that regard. I don't need the alcohol? Eh, shrug? Ugh, see, like, that's weird for me to say. I don't really like that. I'm gonna go up here real quick without that gun. Let's see what's on top. I don't like saying that because, like, I still am addicted. I really should take all this alcohol. Because it still is good, but like... What does that sound? I don't like that sound. What does that sound? Oh, that looks safe. Oh, there's more here? Gotta find the terminal. Oh, no! Oh, Shit. Okay. Well, I can't get that open. That is something. I don't know what that is, though. Hmm. Looks like there's some loot there. Okay. Well, we're good to go, then. I think I'm gonna sleep just to get my tiredness away, and I guess we'll try and carry that shotgun, and then we're going home. We have to go home. Like, we have to go home. We're kind of at a point where it's like, we can't continue on. We're just, we're over-encumbered constantly. I can't even take all this cool alcohol and stuff, which really upsets me. And I really would just like to use buff out, but I can't. And I can't use two grilled venisons, I don't think it stacks. That'd be crazy if it did, but I don't think it does. Okay, so what we're gonna do, 
So we're going to grab the Le Fusil Troubles. Or Terribles. Troubles. The fuck. And then we're gonna drop stuff. Uh, we'll sort by weight. You don't need a spine. Turpentine I really want, but I have plenty of bandages. Beer bottles I need. I don't need that. I don't need that. Adhesive, I need that. Because it's so good. There's so much of that there. Steel. Um, ammo wise, I have anything super heavy I can drop. Fuck, I'm gonna have to store that ammo. I know I left a lot of 556 five, back at the. Uh, holy shit, 27 sim packs. I'll store those. I know I left 556 five, back at the. I don't need mongrel dog meat. At the uh, at the covenant. I'll or the compound. No, I'll, I'll get that eventually. It's fine. I'll drink this bourbon just to get that in my inventory. Bear meat I haven't cooked yet. Do I have a weapon I can drop maybe? Do I even really need a pistol? Like it's so useless to me. Like, yeah, I have 137 bullets for it, but the reason I have that much ammo for it is because it's so fucking useless. I have a feeling a lot of people are going to be upset about the decision I just made to drop that pistol. And I'm sorry, but... There's no point. Why would I want it? I'm going to take the 10mm and store it at home. And we'll be able to find our 10mm pistol in the event that our sanity comes back. But our sanity... What is our sanity right now, anyway? Uh, there it is. Negative 88 still. That's with alcohol. With it. What the fuck? Our sanity is so far in the shit that we're never getting that back. And without the pistol perks, we're never going to be able to use a pistol reliably. And I'm not getting the pistol perks. Because I just... That's not the character I want to build. I'm going for rifle. We're not doing pistol ever. So, yeah. That's fine. We're dropping the pistol. I know a lot of people will say it's a bad idea because we're losing a lot of ammo from that. And I understand that. But at the same time, I think it's a good idea. So... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it turns out. Uh, let's drink the vodka, and then I guess I'll try and grab as much alcohol as I can real quick. Actually, we'll do that next time. Is thing going to end today's survival here? Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.